Hey there YouTube, this is Ross of Woodfire Power and I'm going to show you just a quick little update on um, construction of this aquaponics system. Again we have the fish tank at the highest elevation and then the water from the tank flows down into the gravel media table and there it comes out of a drain and we're putting it below grade so that you don't have to step over it and I'll show you at a later date how I'm playing around with the bell siphon anyway this balloon is working and it's successfully triggering the siphon by releasing the air pressure that builds up when the table water column height comes up into the bell and I have on the way some pressure release valves that operate on like one inch column height of water so we'll see how well those do. Over here is the Duriscrim liner and basically we put it into the um, table starting at the center and working our way to the end so basically um, stapling it down on top of the framing lumber and then we put these trim pieces over the top of that and so that's how the tables are lined I'll do a separate video showing you how to cut the hole through the liner because that is a little bit tricky um, here is the liner material so it's called Durascrim, it's 20 thousandths of an inch thick you can do a search for Durascrim on the internet and you'll find it and here you can see the pleats we made in the liner material. The liner material is made for four foot wide tables so four foot wide one foot deep tables uh, and the liner is six feet wide and here you can see coming together the opener for the greenhouse vent and this is going to be able to open way out there and we set it up like this it's just pivoting on a piece of electrical conduit and I put a couple little screws in there so the conduit couldn't push out and if I look at the one on this end over here you can see the openers they are these um, wax operated guys that automatically push open. We have this one locked for the time being. So this will automatically open the vent. And again, it's pivoting on that. And the important part is that they go up to almost to the peak of the greenhouse so that when they do open they're really going to dump the hot air out of here and then the plastic on the sides will be able to pull up in the spring and summertime uh, and again over here so if I reach my hand in this can pull up and then the whole sides of the greenhouse are open so that's how things are coming along we're just about ready to start planting and buttoning up the whole system.